as long as I stayed connected with God, this journey would be peaceful. I surrendered and I learned. Through this support, I gained confidence, worked on boundaries, and worked on restoring myself. I obtained employment with a steady job that gives me the opportunity to give back. The rescue mission welcomed me in a way that is beyond words. My journey has been about surrender and commitment. If you practice these, I have full confidence this program will work for you. You can't come in here with your old ways, but I guarantee you will leave as a changed person. Before I came here, I didn't know if I wanted to be called a Christian, but I found that being a Christian means to be Christ-like. <laughs> And to emulate Christ is to be the best person you can be. And that's something I can support and embrace. Be kind, be caring, be compassionate, even when others are not. Be someone who can be counted on and learn from the world around you. And most of all, never give up. If there are any words of wisdom, nuggets of truth, or encouragement I could give myself when I sat where you are today, these would be the things that I would tell myself. Congratulations, you did it. Allow yourself to enjoy, experience, and soak up every last piece of truth, love, joy, and encouragement that the mission has to offer you as you prepare to embark on the next steps of your journey, because you will need it. It's not going to be easy, but it will be worth it. Remember that the God that has carried you this far has no intention of dropping you now. His plan and will for you, will for your life, are not always going to align with what you envisioned and thought was best for you. In these moments, do not rush the process. Do not lose heart. Learn and grow from it.